Hey guys, this is Jay Rummy, and I'm the developer of ROM Toolbox, which you can find on the Google Play Store. And today I wanted to share with you an overview of the App Manager. When you open the App Manager, you're going to have three tabs. The first tab lists all your installed applications. The second tab lists your running apps and services. And your third tab lists the backups that you've created with App Manager. To perform an action on one of the apps, all you need to do is click on it. I'm going to go ahead and click on Facebook. And you're going to see a pop-up or a dialog with a lot of different actions and app info. The app info shows you uh, the storage usage, general application info, um, if the app is running, you'll see some process info and the permissions that are inside the app. You can really uh, do a lot of things to the app. You can uninstall it, uh, back it up to the cloud or to local storage, force stop the app if it's running, freeze it, open it, share it with your friends, uh, send the actual APK file with the data, um, and some advanced actions like fixing the app's permissions, um, converting it to a system app, clearing the data, and linking it to the Google Play Store. On the bottom of the of App Manager, you're going to see different uh, buttons or icons in the action bar. You can filter what apps show up in the drawer like all apps, system apps, and even create an app group or hide apps. You can also sort apps by their name, their date, the date they're installed, or their size. And if you want to select an app, um, it's really easy just to click on the app's icon, and that will put you in multi-select mode. And then I could just go ahead and click more apps. Once you've selected the apps that you want to work with, you can back it up, um, uninstall it, freeze the apps, and there's a lot more options to choose from. From the main screen, if you swipe from left to right, you're going to find a sliding menu and more options. You can create a schedule where you can schedule at a certain time of the day um, on multiple days to back up your apps, send them to the cloud, uh, clear data on apps, and all you need to do is uh, click on the different options here and turn the schedule on. It's really easy to create backups of your text messages, contacts, bookmarks, etc. All you need to do is click on the backup phone data. Some different options will show up here. You can select uh, the ones you want and just click backup. To restore it, just go back and click on the restore phone data button. When you back up an app to the cloud like Box or Dropbox, or Google Drive, you can easily restore the app and data um, from that service. All you need to do is click on um, the service that you used. It will then list the apps that you've created backups and that are on Box or Dropbox or Google Drive. And all you need to do is multi-select them, um, press restore, or just select one of the apps and click on the restore button. Multi-selecting is even easier if you use the batch operations. Instead of selecting each app, you can just click on the left sliding menu what you want to do with the app, like back it up to the cloud, and then click on the action that you want to perform. Once you click on the Start button, 
The action is going to run in the background, and all my backups will be synced with box.com. That's it for today. Hopefully you guys like this short overview, and I'll come up with some tutorial videos in the future.